வணக்கம் திஸ் இஸ் ஹைதர் அலி சையத் ஃப்ரம் அசீவகம் யுனைடெட் அண்டர் தமிழ் சேவா ரிமெம்பர் one cannot defeat its enemy until one understand its move who are the enemies of the son of the soil the enemy to the son of the soil are the three policies which were introduced by caucasian settlers through their spy called brahmins those three policies are varna dharma manu shastra and brahmanism we know from history about an advanced civilization established by first siddha tamil shiva lai said is known as first tamil sangam sangam era was called the golden era what was the policy which tamil shiva followed that there was a peace harmony brotherhood and balance of all thing and that age was known as satyugam golden era the policy laid down by first siddha tamil shiva lai said are as follows Asivam coil parliament system which gives power to all varna caste profession they took active part in administration along the side of the pandians headed by the royal blood line of state allies of shiva caucasian settler entered the iranian plateau around 3000 bc later they introduced secret society called mithraism around 1500 bc caucasian settler secret society of mithraism from iran introduce varna dharma what is varna dharma varna means profession remember under the asivagam coil parliament system given by the first siddha tamil shiva alai said all caste varna profession took an active part in administration while under caucasian settlers policy of varna dharma the right to administer the colonies was taken away from all caste only people in administration sector and corporate sector controlled by caucasian settlers spy called brahmins only they rule the tamil colonies as per the law of manu shastra asivagam gives the power to take an active part in administration to the son of the soil in other words power to people while varnadhara policy of caucasian settlers takes away that power from the natives thus making them a slave on their own land the battle between truth versus falsehood is there in every age some of the natives hero from the bloodline of state allies tamil shiva and from its colony who stood against caucasian settler secret society mithraism policy of varnadharam manu shastra and brahmanism for prince gautama chhatrapati shivaji maharaj sambhaji raje guru gobind singh mahatma phule and sir e v r periyar and many more who stood for spiritualism and waged war against anti spiritual policy among the semitic black race from the bloodline of ibrahim they too stood for against caucasian settlers regime whom bible calls the beast saul was appointed as the first administrator later david was appointed as the king of israel from king david bloodline they hold the position of an administrator royal bloodline of david tribe judah and their tribes of children of israel stood against caucasian settlers persian empire roman empire for a long time until children of israel fled from their land thus king jesus mission incomplete as he could not establish the asivagam coil parliament system at the temple of solomon among children of israel of semitic black race during the timeline of prophet muhammad he united bloodline of ibrahim and tamil colonies unity of the native collapsed the caucasian settlers beastly regime thus ending with raised policy of varnadharam manu and brahmanism up from semitic black race prophet muhammad established the asivagam coil parliament system in other words khalifa system among children of israel at Mecca. Mecca, a new administration center for royal bloodline of David, tribe Judah Moors. Remember, Moor ruled Europe for 800 years. So, E.V.R. Periyar did a prophetic job by standing against Caucasian settler secret society policy of Varnadharam, Manu Shastra and Brahman. Dravidian movement based on prophetic agenda, but got diverted by 10 years of reservation introduced by Ambedkar. Dharam is Asivagam Koyal parliament system which gives power to the people in Europe. in other words khalifa system adharam is caucasian settler secret society called mithraism policy of varnadharam the muslim world is caucasian settlers by dna the root cause of all evil they the protector of kaliyuga a small comparison between dmk party and ntk seemant the dmk may be wrong on certain policies but dmk root is connected to sir evr beria prophetic movement ntk seeman career is based on tcp pandey concocted fabricated history based on etymology the language based politician and its team are serving anti spiritual regime whom bible called the beast they helping the secret society called mithraism now illuminati in completion of caucasian settler agenda of aryavarta a humble request to all periyaris a humble request to all shivaite a humble request to all Christians. to unite and once again stand against caucasian settlers policy of mithraism and defeat them and establish the asivagam coil parliament system and let's all enter satyugam golden era and establish kingdom of god nandri vanakkam